Good morning, good afternoon, good evening to wherever you are in the world. Welcome to Sonoma County, where life opens up. Today, we're at Safari West visiting with guest services manager extraordinary Nate Woodward. We're talking about animals in their care, conservation, preservation, environmental education, stewardship, and individual responsibility. The Safari West is in essence a zoo but quite different from your typical zoo experience we have large open pastures with several different species mixed together uh, rather than walking from habitat to habitat and reading signs you actually get in the vehicle with your guide drive through what feels more like the wild and uh, there's no necessarily itinerary to it you see next what is out next and each tour is a little bit different conservation at safari west is at the core of what we do it's why places like this exist uh, we have our beautiful residents here and when folks come to see them they're coming to have fun the way we hope our guests leave us is as uh, people who care more about the animals they saw about their wild counterparts about those animals ecosystems and therefore we've created a group of people that are going to stand up for these animals when they and their homes are threatened. And that's kind of how we get to the conservation of it all. When you come here, you feel more like you're transported to another country. The animals, they behave much the way they would in the wild and having them all together creates a more wildlike experience for our guests here as well. That and can spend the night in our luxury tent cabins. Uh, you can't spend the night at every zoo. That's a really cool thing you get to do here. Uh, altogether, we have about 900 animals that live here, which covers about 90 species. Uh, in terms of the mammals, we're looking mostly African mammals, a few Asian, uh, but mostly African mammals. The birds, however, are completely international. We have a, a bird collection here that spans the globe. We do also do our best to bring kids here, not necessarily in the physical sense, but in an emotional sense for kids in hospitals around the country. A program we started a little over a year ago, Safari West Live. We actually broadcast a live virtual safari tour to kids in hospitals around the country. Um, our guide has a little iPad on the dash where he can see the kids he's talking to. The kids in the hospitals either have an iPad in their lap or they're up on the CCTV watching us as we show them animals. They can say, point the camera over there and get a closer look at that. They can ask us questions about what we're looking at we make it as interactive and as immersive as possible a lot of times we'll see kids receiving care while they watch these shows and they're not even in the hospital they're there with us and it's just such an amazing thing that we get to offer these kids and it's because of the beautiful animals that we have here and a little bit of technology and hard work that we've been able to put in. Since its founding in 1993, Safari West has become one of the premier wildlife destinations in the United States. Their dedication to conservation, environmental education, stewardship, and individual responsibility shows in their many ongoing preservation projects and programs.